Hi, welcome to this tutorial. There was a question on the forum about keyboards and keyboard shortcuts. And I said, okay, let's make a concise video about it. So, I do love my keyboard shortcuts, but where are they in Arch Merge? We have three desktop environments, that's why it's called Merge. It's a merger of three desktop environments. If we're in XFCE, you go to the keyboards. Uh, keyboard and in there you can set your layout of course if you want another layout if I need my Azerti key but if you want something else you just change it here and do an add here here's application shortcut so catfish can be launched if I double click this it's ctrl alt c and then it will be launched chromium the same ctrl alt g and so on so all these applications have, have received an, an, a shortcut Okay, so everything is in here, you can change it, you can delete it, it's in here. Um, this may be interesting to put in the video, super escape. So if you hate something, that something is crashing, as it's loading one second to uh, not fast enough, come, so super and escape gives us this nice little thing and then you kill whatever it is by clicking on it. Now, the question on the forum was as well, where do they do you keep these things? And um, these things uh, are always in these hidden folders. So Ctrl H, view, show hidden files. Ctrl H is how you show these things. But I put them already in here because I tend to go often to the hidden folders. So the .config folder is the one we should look at and the XFCE 4 folder, we are on XFCE, talking about XFCE now. In here, nope, not in here, in here, in here. There are keyboard layout, keyboards, all things that are concerned about, you see it's XFCE. And there is indeed a keyboard shortcut, so you can read it as well in here. It's a little bit different, of course, it's XML, so that's why it looks like this and this strange uh, signs you have to live with it but anyway it's in here so if you want to change GIMP from place you can say F4 is not GIMP and F3 is not Inkscape uh, super F this is super key um, then yeah then you can change it in here you can keep it as well for next installation say I've, I've made all my keyboard shortcuts this is the file you have to uh, put away on github Dropbox OneDrive anywhere and then put it back on after a clean install and all your keyboard shortcuts in XFCE are back. So keyboards and keyboard shortcuts, that's about XFCE. Well, I'm filming this on my Arch Merge system, so I can't really switch now to OpenBox. So it's a SSD bare metal installation. So there are menus in OpenBox to get there, but like always, a graphic user interface is just what it is. Everything you click is going to be written somewhere. And in this case, in OpenBox, it's going to be in here. rc.xml. You can open that one. I'm opening it now with Genie. And in here, you see that Alt F2 is execute and Alt F3 is an other execute, XFCE4 App Finder. So these things, that's this one, these things are in here. You can change them again, you can save them, and next time you'll have it. Okay, that's OpenBox then. And i3 is gonna be in i3, the folder i3 in the config file. If you open that one, scroll all the way down. Let's take some examples. Where is in example? Here are some shortcuts. So applications, keyboard shortcuts. If you don't like them, this is super return. When I press super return, I get my um, terminal, which is termite in our case. What did we do as well? You see that um, these things from i3 work in XFCE. I think that's only normal. We try to have as much compatibility between desktop environments. So one shortcut in one desktop environment will probably work in OpenBox or in XFCE in i3. It's all the same. Some of them will not work due to conflicts and they're not uh, active then. But most of them really, I mean, 95% is just working out of the box. 
and nothing bugs me at this point in time and everything just works the way I want it and um, that's how it's supposed to do to work every keyboard so learn a keyboard shortcuts and it will work in three desktop environments furthermore when when making more and more desktop environments on Arch merged I will always miss my keyboard shortcuts so I will put them in there as well so when we're working on Arch merged awesome in GNOME in Budgie and so on and Cinnamon well we tend to go to these keyboard shortcuts and if they're not there we miss them so yes we'll make keyboard shortcuts there as well all right enjoy your system bye